While a COVID-19 vaccine may be ready in the coming months, CDC Director Robert Redfield told lawmakers the vaccine would likely not be widely available until next summer or the fall. President Trump, though, disagrees with this. 12 News reporter Alexandra Leslie has the details from the Senate hearing, including the director's comments about face masks in relation to a vaccine. Well, Director Redfield told the Senate that while a vaccine could be ready in the coming months, priority would be given to first responders and those who are in high risk categories. In the meantime, though, he says there is scientific evidence that face masks work and they are our best defense against the virus. A Senate appropriations hearing revealed the general public may not be able to get a COVID-19 vaccination this year. I think we're probably looking at third, late second quarter, third quarter, 2021. President Donald Trump claims CDC Director Robert Redfield is mistaken. It's just incorrect information. And I called him and he didn't tell me that you know, we're ready to go immediately as the vaccine is announced and it could be announced in October. Though a COVID-19 vaccine is on the way, health officials say there are already steps people can take to fight off the virus, like hand washing, wearing masks, and avoiding large crowds. In yesterday's Senate testimony, Dr. Redfield, your comment? Rhode Island Senator Jack Reed asked the CDC I director about the effectiveness of masks. I might even go so far as to say that this face mask is more guaranteed to protect me against COVID that when I take a COVID vaccine, because the immunogenicity may be 70%, and if I don't get an immune response, the vaccine's not gonna protect me. This face mask will. Now, Dr. Redfield issued a statement saying that he did not misspeak about vaccines or face masks. He's also urging Americans to get the flu vaccine to lessen the burden on healthcare systems this fall. Live in Pawtucket, Alexandra Leslie, 12 News.